shame off. We're gonna do that extra shame off. We're gonna do that extra shame off. We're gonna do that extra it's January 31st, 2010, and we are at the actual end of the month. Yes, I said we made it through one month before, but this is the actual end, so i got to correct myself. 31 days have passed, and we are heading into February 1st tomorrow. It's going to be a wonderful month. I haven't weighed myself yet. Obviously, I'm waiting for Monday, but, you know, I have hopes. I have uh, high hopes for tomorrow, and if they don't, pan the way I want them to, then, you know what, we're just going to try something different. We're not going to let it get us down. And I'm talking like I'm two people. Us. That's not good. I need to see help for that. I guess I am my own help since I'm going to college for psychology. Maybe I should change my major now. Wow. Um... Today's been uh, just like any other day. Went out and hung out with the guys last night. And we had fun for the most part. There were some ups and downs, but every day is like that. Uh, you know, stayed strong. Jumped right back on everything this morning. Don't let a late night mess up my plans for... I don't know. I can't think of anything stupid to say. But... <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. Um, everything's going pretty well. I got the place to myself tonight, so I'm recording in my apartment. I hope you appreciate that, because it's not too often you get to see this in here. And I appreciate it, because I'm not standing in shorts, in the hallway, freezing to death, with sandals on. Now, I guess I could wear jeans. I guess I could put some socks on and some real shoes. But that requires effort. And I do enough. All my bike riding, all my weightlifting, my other exercises I put in there. I don't want to put pants on. I don't have pants on right now. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to take the extra effort and spend a little bit more energy just to stay warm. My window is open right now. It's winter. But it's nice. It's refreshing. The fresh air gets to me and just fills my lungs with hope. And I'm stupid. Anyway, guys. I just wanted to let you know that everything's going fine. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to do my weigh-in. going to get my measurements done. And you guys are going to see what progress I have. I'm sure that maybe I haven't lost the weight. But I'm feeling that my measurements are going to show. Because I've been hitting that bike pretty hard this week. And I've been building up work, a lot of sweat and workouts and stuff. So, yeah. I believe that we should get this done. Um, excuse me, uh, who, who, who is that? Hey, hey, give that back to me. Give it, give me this thing. Jesus. Hey, I got something real for you guys. You're always back there listening to him, talking about how he's losing weight and he's exercising. That guy's a liar. You know, I mean, he sits there and says, oh, look, I rode my bike today. Did he tell you about the days he didn't ride his bike? Did he tell you how long he rode it each day? Probably said, I wrote it for like 30 minutes. Yeah, it was more like 5 because he couldn't stay on the thing. And then he talks about all this eating right, eating healthy fruits and stuff. No. He's eating chips. He, he's, he's drinking his caffeine. You know, he keeps saying stuff like, oh, got to make a difference, got to change, I'm feeling pumped today. Yeah, he's pumped because maybe he had like 12 hot dogs, some relish on him. You guys are, oh, how can you guys follow someone like that, you know? I mean, this bothers me so much. He sits back there, stupid. Look, oh, I can't even speak now. Look at me, look at me. He sits back there with his stupid glasses. Yeah, his stupid glasses. He gains all his weight, now he's got to cut it off. I'm happy with mine, look it. I'm happy. He was cool before this happened. Now he gets on some health kick. He's got to wear glasses like a nerd. He's got to do his little girly exercises. And he's lying to you about that too. So what's it even matter? And why do you guys sit here and record to a camera? I mean, yeah, I'm talking to a camera right now trying to get a point across. But you guys, why do you do it? You sit there and tell each other, Oh, today I'm, I'm eating oatmeal. I'm snacking on an apple. Nobody cares about a stupid apple. Why don't you go get some Burger King or something? Oh, 
You know, I mean, it just sickens me that you can sit there and try to tell people that you're trying to make a difference in your life. When you know you're cheating, we all know you're cheating. Look how many people dropped off already because they couldn't handle it. That's because they love their Big Macs, you know? I got to get my point across, people. Stop what you're doing. Just stop it now and start living your life. You got one life to live. Eat what you want. If you want to exercise, cool, but you don't have to. You don't need to get healthy. Oh, blood pressure and, and weight. You're going to die young. You're going to die anyway. So you might as well do what you want. Now, I wish there was more that I could say to this because I want you guys to understand I'm real. I did this for what, like 28 years and now this fool's trying to change me? No, I'm here to stay, people. And I'm going to keep discouraging him every second I get. You know those times he's eating those chips and he's lying to you? It's me coming out. I'm showing him how to keep it real. So, I'm going to let you go talk to that loser again. But you just listen to me. Take my word. Take it under consideration. You can make a change in your life. You know, you could be like me. Just cool. Alright. Guys, I am, I'm so sorry about that. That that was completely rude of him. He's gone now. Um, let me set this back up. Alright, I'm I just want to apologize because that's that's who I was. And he he resurfaces every once in a while, but I promise. I, I just want to tell you guys, because I feel really bad right now. There have been a couple times that I did cheat. That I, that I did eat a little bit more than I said that I did. But I was just trying to help you guys. I was trying to, you know, basically stay motivated. Um, even if I do fail sometimes myself, I want to make sure you guys come first. We are, we are the community. We're supporting each other. And if I sit back and just bail out on it, then, you know, what am I going to do? I'm here for you guys. I have been sticking to my diet. This week has been completely strong. You guys have seen my weight loss. You've seen it in the scale readings. I am losing weight. He's just trying to cause more trouble than there needs to be. I, I have to apologize for him because that's that's who I was. I didn't care about anything. I just I wanted to eat and be happy back then. And I'm happy now. It's a different happy, but I'm happy. And God... I almost want to cry. I'm, I'm sorry for how he treated you. Don't listen to any of those things that he said about, you know, not caring about exercising and saying that, you know, anything stupid about making videos. This is what we need. We need this support. We need each other. And I hope that you can continue to watch because I'm going to keep going. All right, bye. Burn, baby. You feel that? Do you feel that? Let's keep that energy up, that motivation. Are you ready?